Canyon in Byron, Maine. Those of you who have never worked this area, it's got quite a bit of bedrock and quite a bit of mining history. This guy, uh, I ran into him at the campground and helped me out. And uh, I'm just doing a clean out now. I've already got a couple of pieces. I'm running the A52 sluice uh, out of this stuff. See the stands set up. Well, you're on Gold Adventures with Bobby Freedom. How y'all doing? Um, there's a little bit of gold there we're getting out of the sluice. Nothing sensational, but close to picker size there. And Well, let's just, the morning start. You never know what the day will bring. Let's see what we got in this pan over here. Got something now? Yeah, it's hard to get the angle, but. Let me get it. Oh yeah, there's some gold in there. Yeah, tilt it a little bit. I think it's because the sun, sunshine. There we go. Well, it's difficult on video. I can't even see. Anyways. Yeah, I'm getting some gold. Wait, hold it like that. Hold it right there. I'm getting some gold here on Coos Canyon this morning. Me and Scott the Unknown. You won't see his face on video, but he's got 18 years of mining experience. All right. We may uh, try another spot. Some gold here. It's all from Coos Canyon, or most of it? All of it. All of it is from Coos Canyon. Awesome. Don't worry, you're not being filmed, just your gold is. That's pretty nice, man. And how long you been coming up to Coos Canyon? This is my first day. <laughs> it's my second. <laughs> Gold Radio Talk. It's about the gold. Gold Radio Talk. It's about the gold. I went looking for some gold today. Turned on my radio. Bobby Freedom was talking away. On his radio show. All right, welcome to the show. How you doing, Sean Palm Ranky? I'm doing good. How you doing? Very well, sir. Thanks for being here. Tonight, our special guest.